Hello YouTubers, this is just a remake of my last video, how to rip and burn DVDs for free, video number two. In the first video, I did not explain how to, um, what to do after a DVD shrink failed to rip your DVD. So, what I want you to do after DVD shrink did not work, did not succeed in removing the encryption, uh, I want you to open up DVD Fab, and DVD Fab is free. It is, um, there's like three versions. There's a platinum, a gold version, and then the standard HD decryptor. Uh, these two you do have to pay for. Uh, just a regular HD decryptor you do not have to pay for. So, as soon as you open DVD Fab, it's going to look like this. And just hit Start DVD Fab HD decryptor. Uh, it's going to look like this. Very basic. Uh, so, what you want to do here is select full disk main movie you want to split it customize it customize the split clone you know etc um personally i just hit full disk i rather have a copy an exact copy of the original and here after your dvd is loaded it's going to analyze it and then you're going to be left with this here you just select the destination uh you put it on your desktop cuz after you're done with this step I mean with the next step you're just gonna delete the the file and after that's done you selected the destination you just hit start and it will start analyzing and decrypting it will take about 20 minutes 20 to 25 minutes to fully rip after that's done just gonna say finish hit finish then close this and you're gonna be left with a folder like that this folder will be uh, I mean, this folder is your movie. <laughs> and again, okay, after this folder is done, I mean, you're done ripping it to this folder there. Uh, then you open up DVD Shrink. DVD Shrink, you're all familiar with if you've seen my previous previous video. If not, this is what it looks like. And, um, okay. Instead of hitting Open Disk, you hit Open Files. Once you're there, it's going to look somewhat like this. It's going to say... Why? Hold on. It's going to be like this. And you're just going to open up full disk. Then um, open up your movie. Mine's American History X. Yours, I'm guessing, will be different. And then here, you click on video underscore TS folder just highlight it and then hit OK it will analyze and well mine's not gonna analyze it because I've done this video so many times and I have failed to like it so it's analyzed it several times after it's done analyzing uh, it's gonna analyze a lot faster than if it was a regular disk because the encryption's gone so after that's done just hit backup and then do the same steps that were in the first video Select, I uh, select ISO image file, then the destination, and then OK. It's gonna be saved as a, a virtual CD. I'm not gonna click OK because I already have it. Then once the once that's done uh, ripping, you'll have your ISO image, and you're done. And then you just gotta close this, trash this. I'm not gonna trash it because I don't know if I'm gonna remake this video, so I'm just gonna leave it out. And uh, that's it. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you liked it. I doubt you would. I doubt you did. But if you did, comment, rate, and subscribe if you'd like. And uh, thanks for watching. Bye.